seals are good, oxygen's good. Just do what you did last time and you're fine. Follow my one simple rule. Hella, what's my one simple rule? Listen to Lynn, boss lady knows best. Exactly. Listen to me, mining's just like any other job. Go steady, go safe, go home with a pocket full of credits at the end of the day. Yeah, totally. It's just like, um, yeah, I work in the Stardock. Except uh, with more cave-ins, lasers, and accidental dismemberment. Very helpful. Thank you. Ah, eh, you're gonna be fine. Your first outing was solid. And, you know, let's be honest, it ain't exactly astrophysics. That's why I keep him around. Good pep talks. Yeah, and the fact that I can pinpoint a helium deposit from 300 meters. <laughs> Not untrue. A shame we won't find any down here. But the metal deposits alone should pay for our own helium. Hell, after this, we'll have enough jump fuel to bounce from one end of the settled systems to the next. Hey, more minerals, more money. And so the cycle repeats itself. Just no more unauthorized jumps in the house for room space, okay? He's just a big baby. There are worse lives. You know, most Dusties don't even make it this far. I have a good feeling about you. A group hug now or at the end of the shift? <sighs> one of these days, Hella, I am going to leave you. Hide. Promises, promises. Okay, let's see what we've got. How are we on time? A uh, little longer. Grab some samples? Always. Uh, but not you. Check on Isabel. Make sure she eases up on the breach. I don't feel like getting buried alive today. Roger that. Remember, Dusty, keep your breathing steady, and never take that helmet off down here. Oxygen processors don't extend this far. Yeah, because God forbid we drill on a rock with a breathable atmosphere. Know what I love about working in Freestar Collective Space? You are red. A job like this in the United Corridor? Huh. Look at this one over here.
I don't. You don't? What we're after? It'll read as an anomaly. That's what I was told, anyway. Okay, now you're starting to freak me out. Relax. It's just another job. Come on. Keep moving. We're getting close, I think. Yeah, everything is just... <laughs> Lynn, seriously, uh, there's something really effed up about this. Where is it, Hella? Through there, I think. Okay, you, you're up. Something goes wrong in there, we'll come get you. Uh, <laughs> why would anything go wrong? Would you shut up? Both of you, do your jobs. Client is on his way. Hey, uh, good luck in there. What are you waiting for? Do your job. Take it easy. You were out cold. Uh, no physical damage. Mentally, the jury's still out. You know who you are? New recruit for Argos Extractors? Ring any bells? Any of this look familiar?
Kind of ironic seeing a former combat medic out for the count with a head injury. But hey, it's what you signed up for. Well, you got the sample. Client's on his way, then we all get paid. You remember anything that happened? Huh. Well, you passed out, that's for sure. Everything else? Probably just your brain playing tricks. Either way, we got what we were looking for. All this trouble for that stupid thing? Huh. Sure don't look like much. Never mind what it looks like. It's worth more than this mine has pulled in all month. We'll be... Speak of the devil. Contact is on approach. Wait, the explorers group? <laughs> Not a joke. Not a joke. You're just too young to know better. Hey, I'm just saying they got a reputation. Hell, I bet half the crew here doesn't even believe they really exist. Half the crew doesn't believe Earth exists, but it's still there. Same with Constellation. Yeah, but come on. Exploring space does that anymore? Ain't the space we've already got complicated enough? Not to them, apparently. Whoa. You don't look good. Not interested. You got somewhere else to be. This has been a good run. You lucked out being picked up for this one. Argos usually ain't so good at picking sights. Oh, this time, <laughs> like a miracle. Yeah, all right. Need some coffee or something? Got a packet around here somewhere. Be glad when we're off this rock. Hey. Bitch.
I'm busy. Is there anyone else to bother? How'd they sucker you to join? Fall for the fancy pamphlets? Lynn sure seems to like you. Guess she would know, being the boss and all. You fitting in okay? Mining crews ain't the friendliest, but they're good folks. Supervisor's log supplemental. Still day two of Argos Extractor's Vectera dig. Freestar Collective claim ID Beta 7548 Alpha. As far as anyone knows, this is just another ore run. Vectera's got enough mid-level veins to keep everyone working and not asking questions. I've told Hella everything he needs to know, which is pretty much everything I know. That this is another one of Barrett's special orders. He made good with the payment for Kazal, even if it was a bust. This time, I'm not so sure. This place is giving me the willies. I think we're going to find... something. I just have no idea what it could be, or why Barrett might want it. But those sweet constellation credits mean we dig our holes and keep our mouths shut. And I'm okay with that. Hopefully, between Barrett's mysterious thing and the ore itself, we'll be done with this rock in five days, when the transport is supposed to come back for extraction. to be getting longer. That's Argos for you. Squeeze every credit they can. You got a few more digs to go before I feel like talking to you. Just trying to get through my shift. Hey, watch it! Yeah, all right. Uh, you think we'll be done here soon? No, I hear this is the last dig. Uh, hey, that was my sandwich! And... Careful! What? Ah, oh, I'm working. All right, Dusty. Airlock. Put your helmet on.
Yes, it has. That mine on Bendy, right? Kazal, hellhole, like this place. Rare mineral contract. Your tastes are a bit more sophisticated now, huh? So, you found something? Right here. The new guy found it. That right. And everything went cool? Just like grabbing those minerals on Bendy? Kazal. And no, Barrett. Not cool. He passed out after the extraction. Woke up saying all kinds of nonsense. Is that right, cowboy? Went on a trip, huh? <laughs> that fun, huh? Not the most gentle push into the great mysteries of space, but hey, been there. Look, just hand over the credits, and I'll be happy to never see this thing, or you, ever again. That's why I like you, Lynn. All business. Barrett, the scanners on the frontier are reporting a ship coming in hot from orbit. I really thought I'd lost them.
believe the Crimson Fleet hit us. You in one piece? Good. Me? I was just gonna pass out as soon as my heart stops racing. be coming out of our pay. Go ahead. Now that was some fine work on the pressure. You dug up the artifact, right? That means you saw it. The visions? You're coming with me to Constellation. You're part of this now. You ever stare up at the stars at night wondering what's out there? Well, that's us. That's where we go. Hey, um, I wasn't gonna bring it up, but we don't exactly know what the artifact might have done to your head, and Constellation is really the only group qualified to help. Oh, no, Barrett. No. You think you're just going to take off after the mess you caused? All right. I guess I did just put you all on the Crimson Fleet hit list. How about I stay and I send your Dusty here in my place? I, 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 I know, I know, but he's not some miner anymore, Lynn. Soon as he touched that rock, something changed. 
Don't tell me you can't feel it. Fine. It's a deal. Get out of here, Dusty. You're on to bigger things. Don't you get it? You don't have a job here anymore. You're with those explorers now. Like it or not. Just go, alright? Figure out what happened to you when you touched that rock. Well, none of that's settled. Vasco! Get him to the lodge! No deviations unless absolutely necessary, okay? Protocol Indigo. Indigo? Again? Very well. Oh, and hey, take this. You'll find it very useful out there, and it even tells the time. Hey, look at that. The watch fits you perfectly. Now, questions? See, that's the problem with the settled systems. Too easy to take everything for granted. While everyone else is busy playing politics, we're the ones braving the unknown, charting the vastness of space. Without us, the galaxy is just a big room with the lights turned out. Technically, it's not even mine. Consider it alone. Vasco will keep you on course. Besides, I'm making an exception, since you can tell Constellation about that vision you had. Come on. You're really not at all curious about that light music show you experienced? Why it only affected you? Because if you didn't notice, we've all been handling it since with no problem. The way I see it, Constellation needs that artifact, but they also need you. This mystery is only getting bigger each step we take. And you're part of it now. That, my friend, is the million credit question. And Constellation can find the answer. With your help. They're just following the loop, like pirates do. And I have something of a reputation as a loot collector. And Vasco, don't let him break my ship. You are the new captain of the frontier, just up the ramp, Captain. I'll be in the external robotics bay. Captain, Protocol Indigo is in effect. Captain, I assume... You know the drill, Vasco. Protocol Indigo means no deviations, no distractions, no dalliances. In short, no fun. Unless, as strictly defined by Sarah, said deviations, distractions, and dalliances are completely necessary in getting this fine vessel, the Discovery-class Starship Frontier, back home in one piece. I guess I'm still technically borrowing it from Constellation, even if I have no intention of actually giving it back. You know how to fly a Class A starship. As Barrett likes to say, it's as easy as learning to ride a bike. I will attempt to boost the shields, just in case there are any difficulties. Thank <laughs> you. 
rest is up to you.
stop. We will need to deal with the local Crimson Fleet captain. A recent scan indicates an abandoned facility on the nearby moon of Crete. A perfect staging area for pirates.
research facility is in this direction. creatures are often dictates that I am to return to the Lodge with no deviations. We are here to stop the Crimson Fleet from pursuit. Nothing more. I will accept any and all items. say that billions of years ago, we were all one with the cosmos, so technically you have known each other forever, but the more practical answer is likely that he needs you. The number of known people who have been affected by the artifacts is now two. Without your investment in Constellation's mission, he may never know more about the experience you both share. So, he is showing you trust in order to gain your support.
base was once a secret UC facility. speed with your pack that full. programmed for combat. Allow me to assist you with carrying your items.
Am I currently in possession of an item you require? and fleet have something of a history. They always assume he is a treasure hunter in possession of valuable objects. They are wrong. Usually. I will keep your items safe, Captain. everything yourself. Carrying objects is one of my simplest and most useful protocols. reducing our travel speed.
need to assist in carrying some supplies. It occurred to me that you have undergone considerable physical and emotional. I am ready to commence a trade.
too much matter and become over encumbered.
I am capable of carrying additional supplies, if necessary. Captain, Protocol Indigo, may I take some things?
butchered. Avoid getting shot. You might die. 